and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that if 16C0, 16C1, 16C2 and so on up to 16C16 with the coefficients in the expansion 1 plus x whole raised to power 16 prove that 16C1 plus 16C3 plus 16C5 and so on up to 16C15 is equal to 16C0 plus 16C2 plus 16C4 plus so on up to 16C16. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know a result. And that is 1 plus x whole raised to the n is equal to nc0 plus nc1 into x plus nc2 into x square plus so on up to ncn into x raised to the n where absolute value of x is less than 1. Now this result will work out as a key idea for solving out this question. And now we will start with the solution. Here for expanding 1 plus x whole raised to power 16 we will use the result which is given in the key idea. So this will be equal to 16c0 plus 16c1 into x plus 16c2 into x square plus so on up to 16c16 into x raised to power 16. Now let us put x is equal to minus 1. Then we get 1 plus minus 1 all raised to power 16 is equal to 16c0 plus 16c1 into minus 1 plus 16c2 into minus 1 square plus so on up to 16c16 into minus 1 raised to power 16. So this implies 1 minus 1 all raised to power 16 is equal to 16c0 minus 16c1 plus 16c2 minus 16c3 plus 16c4 plus so on up to 16c16. Now this implies 0 is equal to 16c0 minus 16c1 plus 16c2 minus 16c3 plus 16c4 and so on up to 16c16. Now shifting negative terms on one side and positive terms on the other side, this implies 16c1 plus 16c3 plus so on up to 16c15 is equal to 16c0 plus 16c2 plus 16c4 plus so on up to 16c16. Hence, we have proved that 16c1 plus 16c3 plus 16c5 plus so on up to 16c15 is equal to 16c0 plus 16c2 plus 16c4 plus so on up to 16c16. So this is the solution of the given question and that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.